these mirrors concentrate the heat of the sun onto this central tower in southern Spain, turning water into steam and, in a working power plant, driving a power turbine. Concentrated solar power, CSP, has the potential to bring energy to remote areas of the world. But CSP has a fatal flaw. It's extremely thirsty. This type of solar energy is perfectly suited to deserts with their strong sunlight. But desert sand and dust means all the mirrors need regular cleaning using precious water. Here at the PSA Solar Test Centre, scientists are working on water-saving experiments, among them barriers to stop the dust from reaching the mirrors in the first place. The barrier that's working best so far is the one with a flat geometry. Compared with a curved one, we get slightly better results, and if we compare it with a natural barrier, the results are spectacular. With the artificial barrier, we can block up to 50% of the particles and stop them from entering the solar field. Cleaning the gigantic mirrors uses lots of liquid. Researchers are testing an ultrasonic cleaning system which uses less water as part of an EU project. We're using a manual system to perform the experiments for a year in which we'll obtain results on water consumption, electricity consumption, and the next step will be to scale up the device in a working solar plant using an automated system. Special coatings to stop dirt sticking are being tested. Measurements taken by hand show when surfaces need cleaning, but this sensor does the work automatically. And a hybrid water cooler prototype with both wet and dry cooling towers has just been installed. In France, researchers are working on a different type of cooler using jets of water mist. Concentrated solar power has one big advantage over the better known solar panels. Heat produced can be stored and used long after the sun has set. So it's a technology well worth refining via smart cooling and cleaning. We're adding a water mist system which will cool the air before it gets to the heat exchangers, so we'll have a much more effective cooling system. We should be able to reduce water consumption by more than 90% compared to a traditional wet cooler. The team is also working on an innovative device to store cold air this tank which is filled with layers of rock and water. In effect, it stores the fresher night air which can then be used to cool the turbine condenser using no water at all. CSP power stations have an important role to play in the coming years. The irregularity of renewable energies is quite a problem and CSP allows us to store energy and produce electricity 24-7 with costs which can be very attractive. Many of these experiments will soon be tested in working power plants and could be commercially available within three years.